Hey there everyone, how's it going? Tarun here and in this video we are going to look about redirection. Now first of all what is redirection? It is a way to send both the users or the search engines which are going to like crawl through your page to another URL. Okay? It is kind of similar to that href which you use but this is specifically used in like certain situations where we do not want the user to click and be redire redirected but we want it to be like an automatic process like say for example you are like performing some calculation and once that calculation is performed and the result is shown you want to like redirect in few seconds so that is when this redirection is used now how do we redirect for that let me like demonstrate it to you let me first write the basic say the what is it called it's called the what is this whole thing called yes you're right it's called the boilerplate code so we have the boilerplate code in the hand now don't worry about if you don't understand these tags they are just meta tags which are actually data about data which means it is a data about this page okay it is totally safe to remove them as of now you can feel free to remove this also but just include the html tag okay now within the body i'm going to include script tag to write the javascript in and here i'm going to have a button and value let me tell click me to redirect okay so what do we do once this button is clicked we want some function to be called let that function be called redirection okay and let's write that function here function redirection and within this we're going to write the code now it is just a single line code what we're going to do is window dot location equal to the page where you want it to be redirected Okay, say we want to go to the google.com domain. So this is where we want to get, want it to be redirected. So that, that is it. Now let's, let's try this on Chrome. Okay, we have this button and once I click it, it goes to Google. So that is how this redirection works. Okay, we have the button. Now one, one more thing in this video I want to show you is how to reload on click okay so let's duplicate this line by the way i do it with shift alt and um, the down arrow which brings me this click me to reload and let the function be named reload and let's again duplicate this shift alt bottom button and change this to yep that was right reload and the way you reload is you just call window.location.reload and close it. You can feel free to delete this. Okay, window.location.reload. Now to prove you that it is actually getting reloaded, uh, just a minute, uh, I just want to check one thing. It's all right, fine. So window.location.reload. To, to prove that it's actually reloading, let me add a p tag. Okay, with ID of this, not DOS, fine, any ID. Hello, this would disappear. And let's grab one more button and change it to vanish. And let the function be named vanish2. And let's write the function. it would be named vanish and here the code if you had like had an intuition it's going to be like we're going to make this text disappear okay for that you write document dot get element by id again don't worry if you don't understand this line because i would be covering it for you in the um, the dom part okay don't worry here what i'm doing is i'm just from the document object i'm getting the element that that paragraph element by calling this dot 
inner html in the sense i'm telling whatever the inner html is there set it to null set it to nothing okay now our demonstration code is ready i'm going to show you how it's going to get redirected and those things okay now we have the page let me reload it once okay so if i click this it redirects if i click this it reloads okay and to prove that i'm gonna make it vanish okay it disappears now once i reload it appears okay the whole page reloads so that is how you do the page redirection using like window.location equals to and reload is like window.location dot reload that is reload so if you have any doubts please let me know i'm really happy to clarify it to you otherwise see you guys in the next video goodbye and by the way, all of this code is available on GitHub uh, and the link will be like anywhere here. Okay, uh, just find it out or just ping me. I'll send you the link. You can like download the code. You can go through it. You can try modifying it or personally, I would suggest you to like type it out in your computer, change these values and try it out. Okay, thank you.